Hey everybody! I'm gonna head out the door in a few minutes, but I thought before I do I should film an outfit of the day video. It's a Saturday and I'm in a really basic dressy casual outfit and I'm gonna go run some errands first and then a few hours down the road I'm gonna go meet up with some friends and we're gonna go um, get dinner and maybe have a few drinks. So I'm in an outfit that I think can transition from day to evening and it's a really, it, like I said, it uses a lot of basics and honestly could be put together in like two minutes. It was really quick and easy and I would say most people have these items or something similar to them in their closet because they are staples. So as you can see, I'm in a dressy casual outfit today and every item that I'm wearing is a basic piece that every woman should have in her wardrobe. And if you don't, you really should invest in some. So the only statement piece that I'm really wearing today is my necklace, but I'll get a little closer to show you. So first I'm wearing a basic fitted black blazer and it has a single button and uh, it's not too long, not too short, and it has quarter sleeves with a little bit of ruching on the inner arm at the elbow, which creates sort of a pushed up sleeve effect even though the sleeves aren't pushed up. And every single woman should own a black blazer in her wardrobe. Doesn't matter the sleeve length, whatever makes you feel comfortable, but everyone needs a basic fitted blazer. Um, this is made by 548. I might be saying that wrong, I don't know. Um, I got it on clearance at the Saks Fifth Outlet and I got the same blazer in a gray and I think I spent, because it was like 50% off clearance, so I think for the two I spent like 25 bucks, which was awesome because I think these were like 100 each. And um, I'm wearing a basic v-neck white t-shirt. Mine is tissue thin though, so I think I'm going to put something else on underneath because I'm concerned that you can see through it. Um, but yeah, so just your basic v-neck. This is made by LNA. They make wonderful basics and this one is super duper soft. On the bottom, I'm wearing a fairly dark wash skinny jean. And these are kind of a jegging, I guess, because they have a lot of spandex in them. So they're thinner than your standard um, heavyweight jean. And these are... I'm only 5'5", five five, so finding a pair of jeans that actually fits me and isn't way too short or way too long is really difficult. So for me to find jeans that actually fit in the leg is outstanding. These are made by Joe and I got them at, I got them again on sale at the Saks Fifth Outlet. So for, these were pretty expensive jeans and I think I got them for around 60 bucks. So that's always a great deal. And I'm wearing on my feet just a basic black pump. This is has a rounded toe and has a platform, has a platform, so it's pretty easy to walk in even though these are high. And these were, I think, by BCBG Girls or BCB Girls. I don't know how you say that, but yeah. Again, I got these at a like a discount shoe place, and these were probably like thirty dollars. So even though they were much more expensive than that. I'm a really good discount shopper. Outstanding, if I may toot my own horn. Now for my bag, I'm just carrying a slouchy black bag, and it has gold hardware, which goes with the rest of my outfit. And it has a shorter handle and a really long one, which I love because I can go shopping and just put it around me, and it's completely hands-free. And if you are a busy mom and you've got kids to take care of, a bag that goes over the shoulder like this is an absolute necessity. Now although it's a beautiful day outside, it is fall so it can get a little chilly. So one thing that I'm going to bring with me and just shove in my bag is a scarf. And this one has a lot of browns and aubergines and black and it's just a really nice accent but it's also subtle enough to go with the outfit. So if I get cold I'll just dig into my bag and reach in and you know, put this on. And this scarf is made by RZ Rachel Zoe, which is the line she has on at QVC. So this is a look that I put together in literally like two minutes and is a very easy go-to piece. So let's see if I move back a little further if you can see my entire outfit right now. I think you can see that. Do -do 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 -do, those are my shoes. So that's it for my outfit of the day. This look literally took me two minutes to put together and it's a great go-to piece when you're in a rush or when you just can't think. It's great for dressy casual situations, casual situations. You could change out the shoes easily and put on black ballet flats and 
you would be still super chic and very comfortable. Now I'm going to show you how I paired this outfit with accessories and makeup. I went for a really bold necklace. This is made by House of Harlow and it is black enamel with a little bit of gold on the side and I think it's pretty bold and I really like this. So, But because this is such a statement piece I went really delicate and everyday on the rest of my jewelry. I'm just wearing a really delicate little opal ring and then I just have on simple gold knot stud earrings. I'm wearing a basic black pump. These are by BCBG Girls, and I'm pretty sure they're not real leather, but they are supposed to mimic leather. And they have a hidden platform inside, so they're a little easier to walk in. And then they have a, you know, just a regular heel and a rounded toe. Now I'm going to show you my scarf for in case I get cold, and these are just supposed to be feathers. So the makeup that I have on right now is what I was wearing in the Dior holiday video, um, the one that was the haul and the review. I haven't decided yet if I am going to do, do a tutorial on that, so I don't know. But like I mentioned in that video, I really didn't like the eye palette, so that's kind of why I might not do one. And instead of the red lip that I had on in that video, because it's still daytime and I thought it was a little dramatic with a smoky eye and a red lip, so I just took that off and I put on a pinky nude and I'm wearing a Chanel Rouge Coco Shine in Boy. I got this bag for Christmas last year and I love it. It's kind of slouchy, so it's not super formal looking. And it is so roomy. Even from the side, it may not look like it's that big, but it holds so much stuff. This pretty much holds my life. And it's your basic black leather bag, and it has gold grommets on either side going up across the top. So it's really fun and flirty, but tough at the same time. And can also, of course, be very classic. So this bag is so versatile. And then it has a standard over-the-shoulder strap, but it also has a removable super duper long one so you can wear this bag over your shoulder. Um, it has the dog leaf, dog leaf, dog leash um, closures so you can remove it easily. And I adore this bag. I have worn it so much. So that's it for my outfit of the day video. Please let me know if you guys want to see more of these. I, you know, I, I know I have a few kinks to work out when I film these, but I did kind of like doing this, so let me know if this is something that you guys are interested in, and I will be happy to post more. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!